Hi everyone, my name is Christina from Tampa, Florida. If you're planning to tow a trailer with your Ford Fusion, you need trailer wiring. It's required by the law. Let's give you a breakdown. Our trailer wiring on this vehicle is gonna be done in the trunk of it. So our next step is gonna be removing the floor panel in the trunk. So our next step is to remove the threshold panel by removing two plastic clips behind it. If you have any issues removing the plastic clips, use your wire cutter to pry them out. So our next step is to remove the threshold out by pushing up. And the threshold is being held by this clip. Our next step is to remove the cargo tied down on the driver's side. Next, we're gonna remove this plastic clip in the top part of the trunk. Okay, we're gonna remove, pushing up the clip out of the panel lining in the trunk. And we're gonna pull our cargo lining forward towards inside the trunk. So our next step is to remove the driver's side tail light. You will remove two nuts inside So we have a body plug holding the tail light on the, on the inside. Our next step is to use our prime tool to remove it, popping to the outside. Our next step is to remove the tail light connector by pushing this clip down. Now, our next step, we're gonna grab our driver's side connector with the yellow wire, and we're gonna bring it in to this grommet inside the vehicle. Next step is to pull the plug out. Now, we're gonna make a clean cut to the grommet. So now we're gonna grab a stiff piece of wire to fish wire our connector from the inside of the trunk to the outside of the tail light area. Now you're gonna fill for it and pull it through. Now we're gonna tape our connector to the fish wire. Now, we're gonna guide our fish wire with the plug through the hole. Now we're gonna pull the wire with the connector. It's gonna be hard, but you need to guide the connector with your hands to bring it out the tail light. We're gonna match our plugs and connect them. Until it clicks. Now we're gonna plug the tail light to our connector. And we're gonna place back tail light into position.
Now we're gonna place our nut back onto the tail light using our 10 millimeter socket. We will place our wire through the grommet, cut and place back. Now we're gonna use our connector with the green wire and repeat on the passenger side. Now we're gonna ground our wiring to the battery. If you don't have a battery on the trunk of your vehicle, you're gonna ground it to the body. Now using a 10 millimeter socket, you're gonna tie it down. Now we're gonna connect our power wire. Let's prep our fuse holder. We're gonna remove the cover and using a 10 millimeter socket, you're gonna release the knot. Now we're gonna take our provided 10 amp fuse and place it in our fuse holder. Now we're gonna clean up our wires using zip tight. There's two options to store your four-way flat wire. 
You can leave it inside the trunk of your vehicle or you can run it underneath your vehicle and mount it on a bracket. Let me show you how to do it. Now we're gonna push our wire through the same grommet we brought our yellow wire. Now that we have our wire underneath the vehicle, we're gonna put our grommet back. Now we're gonna place our trunk back together. Now that we have our four flat underneath the vehicle, we're gonna place our bracket. Now, with your 10 millimeter socket, you're gonna tighten in. Now let's place our four flat into the bracket. And place our dust cover. Now we're ready to tow. Thank you for watching our videos. If you have any questions about this product seen in this video, or if you would like to schedule an installation with a U-Haul Hitch professional, visit us online today at uholhitches.com.